Hi, Single Daddy here, and today I'd like to do a review of the Philip 2, which is a smart wristwatch for kids. It's also a loca location uh, tracking device. And um, bought one for my daughter for Christmas, and didn't really see any good reviews. Uh, well, not good reviews, but I didn't really see any reviews online, <clears throat> or at least very few. I saw uh, a couple that were good. It was uh, one was from uh, David Hansel, and he uh, did a good product review. I highly recommend looking at that. It goes through all the features about it. Um, but I was looking for uh, something where the kids were kind of reviewing it. So you know, they're the ones that are wearing it. So I wanted to see how uh, the kids reacted to the phone. And there was one good one from uh, uh, Sean. Um, uh, what's the last name? Sean. Sean something or other, but anyway, I'll put I'll put a link for both of the, those reviews below. Um, but Sean's was for the F Philip One, and there wasn't a good kid-centered review for the Philip Two. So I interviewed my daughter earlier in the day, and we're going to see what her reaction is to the uh, to the Philip Two. Hi. Hello. Hi. It's Daddy and Sydney. And uh, today we're going to do a review of Sydney's Christmas present that we got her to, uh, for Christmas. And it is, the product is a flip. Okay, so this is, uh, this is the box it, come, it came in. It was shipped by UPS um, before Christmas. Um, and it's kind of, uh, with all the electronics and stuff, we kind of have that. And I have a charger with. And there's a charger. We're going to show you. It. We're going to show you everything. Okay. So uh, we're going to pretend like we're just opening the box. Okay. And inside the box, of course, it was all wrapped in much neater. It was a Christmas present, so you know we had to. Uh, we had to open it up. Um, and uh, it's super simple. You've got uh, you got this this charging cord, and I want to show you in a second this um, this charging device. It's magnetized, so it's super easy to use. Yeah, you can do it, okay? Um, but I did want to show the watch first, okay? So here is the... Watermelon pink. It's watermelon red, that's right. Red. And, um, or pink. And um, It has a little thing there, mm -hmm. but eventually Daddy needs to buy a new one of those because if you try to, like, take this one off, and it will eventually pinch my skin really bad and it will hurt really bad. So he needs to buy a bigger one yeah. so we can actually like. So right now it's just like so you can have it on, then open this up and take it off, and then this is so you can leave it on. Right. Where you can't um, what do you call it? You can't take it off. Well, you can take it off. We tried it with her. Um, this this little thing. The the previous model just had this had this open face. Some, I guess some people didn't like that. It won't fall off. I mean, this is kind of a hard, I mean, it, it's flexible, but it's not uh, too flexible. Anyway, they come with a spacer here, but you can take that out. And we tried this initially, which would make it um, kind of a, if you can see that, it make it kind of a closed face here. But this one was too small for Sydney. Now they have a store that you can go to and buy more of these, um, or bigger, si larger sizes of it. Because um, when we tried it on her, it pinched her skin. So we're, oh, yeah. we're going with this for right now. Um, and uh, and that, it works just fine. She was at, um, where were you yesterday? Um, uh, Moody Garden. What? No, no, no. Where? Boingy, boingy, boingy. Where oh, were you yesterday? Jumping World. Jumping World. Went to Jumping World yesterday. Mm -hmm. She wore it the whole time. Didn't fall off. So it's, it's super secure. I mean, she was jumping for an hour. <laughs> um... All right. So anyway, um, Sydney, you show them how to how to put it on. So and you explain everything that you want so to. So you can you can put it on either wrist. There is not an instruction. You have to put it on the left arm. So well, you actually, you know that's an interesting thing. Sydney is left-handed, and we found out just now we were doing some Christmas present stuff. We found out that she uh, it's, it's hard for her to write. It's such a bulky thing when she puts her put your hand down to write with your left hand. Because this is like, when you do this, it kind of like gives you a cushion to like, Yeah, it just elevates like your that, waist up so she can't, can't really write. They can't see but, you. Oh, but all right. So anyway. So, um, you can take it off too, but I would take it off like this, which okay. is 
doesn't really hurt, but this is kind how of does it? Strange. How does it feel on your wrist? Well, it kind of gives me a little pressure, mm -hmm. um, and it gives me a mark, like, when I take it off. Mm -hmm. like Around the mark. edges a little bit? Yeah, like that. Um, but it's good, and... Is it comfortable when you're wearing it? Yes. Yes. Okay. And so, um... The well, material, the material is like a, a like a rubber, um, like really hard rubber. Yeah, like a hard rubber, and it's not, you know, it's kind of rounded on the edges and stuff like that. So go ahead, put it this on. This is plastic. Or show it, them, or however you want to do. Um, this is how you put it on, and it can like show you the battery. Oh wait a minute. Right, All right, we'll show them. We'll show. The, yeah, we'll show them the features. Okay, so batteries. All right, batteries is a good thing. Um, so maybe you want to show them now how. Easy it is to plug in. Tell, tell them how old you are so that they know. So I'm seven and a half. Seven and a half, of course. You must use that. Um, half. And there's, I don't think you can see it, but there's a little charger like right here. See it? Right there. And here's this little thing. If you want to charge it. Show, lift um, it up. I can't see it. All you have to do is Higher, plug take yeah. it like this and it will snap on and then it will say it's charging. But you need to plug it in. And it will make a little sound, like ding ding or something like that. Mm -hmm. And you plug it in, and then it will charge. Do you think that's something that would be too hard for you? No. No? But my... See, all you gotta do is you just gotta get it. Let's go closer. Closer to the camera. All you gotta do is just get it kind of close to it. You hear it just kind of clicks in, turn around so they can see. Take it off. See, it just, just like that. That's it. Simple. And then... Uh, of course, you gotta plug it in, and it comes with uh, it's a USB D D, so you could, you know, plug it into the computer. But uh, that's something that would be easy for you. <laughs> okay. So. Um, um, now, um, maybe you want to show them how to. Okay, so let me put it on. Yeah, put it on and show them, show them how it works. Okay. So I can get text messages. It will put on like a little ringer. So that, like, like if Daddy wants to say I love you or how is your day today or something like that, um, a ringer would come on and then I would look down and then the message would be on this. And how I would call him. Oh, I'm calling, but I'm just gonna yeah, because of, of we're so, recording on my phone. So, so um, like that, and then. Well, right now it's saying the time, but I'm going to see it says call daddy and mm -hmm. also it says call mommy. Mm -hmm. Then um, I'm not going to do it right now, but I would press this red button. Then it would make the sound of someone calling and then they would answer. And then they get the call, right? Mm -hmm. um, <clears throat> but I can't send text messages. I want to, but I can't. And also, I can't FaceTime on this. No, it's not that. Uh, yeah, it's sort of like a. So it's I, I, what I, what I like about it is it's a way of giving her a phone without actually giving her a phone. You know, because a phone's a lot of responsibility. But this is a good step up to uh, to that and allows communication. Another cool, very very cool thing about it is the emergency button. Oh yeah, the emergency button. So there's two, there's two little buttons right here. One's black and one's red. So if I want to call somebody, I'll push this blast back. Uh, what do you call it? Black button. <laughs> and um, and um, say I wanted to call uh, Daddy. I'm guessing. And um, I forgot how to hang up. Um, like. To hang up, um, you just, after you're finished the call, you just push this red button. But anyways, there's two buttons, but if there's an emergency, like someone's taking me away or I get kidnapped or something like that, um, I have to see there's two of them, and the emergency button is that um, red button. How long do you have to press it? For five seconds. You have to hold it down like this. Don't, don't do it now. <laughs> uh, yeah. I'm gonna like hold it down one, two, three, four, five, and then um, eventually it will show where I am on Daddy's phone, 
and that I will tell them what the emergency is about. Right. Well, it, 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 what it's going to do is going to call my phone, um, and if it doesn't reach me, it'll go through all the contacts. You can get as many as five people uh, on that phone, but it'll call everyone, starting with the primary, until it finally reaches somebody, and it will let us know there's, there's an emergency going on. And, and, and the key here is just to let Sydney know what's an emergency, what's not an emergency. So, um, so I think she, I think she understands that well, and and uh, so it's a, I think it's a great <clears throat> safety uh, feature, and so, uh, um, like I would eventually like they would come for me, mm -hmm. and stuff like that, um, and then to hang up, it would be the same on the emergency call. Be, it would be the same to hang up on them. No, I don't think so. I think it'll just mm -hmm. it'll keep calling until I pick up. But we don't need to worry about that. So, <clears throat> so tell us, Sydney, what do you think of your phone? So I like it, and um, it's a really cool thing. Um, I wouldn't say it's better than a phone. Um, it would say like either this, um, like five thirty, you would show that, or it would say. Uh, December, whatever. Or yeah, whatever. needless to say, it's also a, a, a wristwatch. It's helping you learn time, right? Mm -hmm. We learned right about now, it just says 11. Sometimes 50, it has words, sometimes it has. I'm like, sorry, go ahead. Um, has, uh, what do you call it? Uh, numbers. Numbers like December or January or February or like oh, April oh, dates, or dates. whatever. Um, and then, um, so, it would, event, you know, it say, show the little battery, um, to see how much, but, um, this little battery, um, has as much, and right now, I only have, like, that much, it's barely anything, less battery, but. It's mostly full. Yeah. Yeah. Because, when I charge it in, and I'm sleeping, <laughs> Um, when I'm sleeping, well, my dad used to tell me, when I'm sleeping, it's sleeping, which means it's charging overnight. That's so. what we told her. We said, basically, how to take care of the phone is that the phone's going to sleep when you sleep. And mm -hmm. we charge it just like you charge your batteries when you sleep. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. So, would you tell people that uh, this is a good thing to buy mm -hmm. or no? Maybe they should get something different. Well, you could get it like... A phone, but this is a good thing for me. Okay. Good job, Steve. So, um, right. Right. Ready to say bye? Yeah. Okay. Bye. Bye. -bye.